What is up guys, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred back again with another trailer reaction review or reaction video to the brand new Nintendo Indie World video. I don't know if it was live stream, I must have missed it, the Indie World Showcase. Gonna hit play, we're gonna be checking it out. Don't know what we're gonna expect, it's Indie. Obviously, I'm not expecting no big hitters. I'm praying that we get some magical cadence of Hyrule situation where a Nintendo IP has been integrated and worked with an indie developer, giving them not only a light and, you know, a boost up, but giving us as fans a dope way to experience a Nintendo IP in a different light in a different way. Hopefully, that is the case. Not expecting too much. It's 20 minutes long, so definitely got a lot of games to go through. Without no further ado, let's jump into it. Okay. Starting off with, um... I was gonna say pop-up girls. <laughs> This be a brain game. Not even. It's Indie World Showcase. It's nothing. <laughs> I thought they were showing a game. Ooh. What the golf? Not what the golf. Um, golf story. There's a new golf story? No. That one. Yeah, it's golf story. Golf story 2? Tennis story. Anyway, in bed, send a story. Yep. Volleyball story, soccer story. What the hell? Baseball story. <laughs> Sports story, okay. Okay. I like that idea. This is cool. Hi, everyone. That's Thanks cool for joining sequel. us. I'm Kirk Scott, your friendly neighborhood indie guy. And I'm What's Sam up? Robertson. Welcome to Indie World, a look What's ahead up? at some great indie games coming to the Nintendo Switch system. Let's do it. We're thrilled to kick off this edition of Indie World with Sports Story, the sequel Sports to story. Golf Story and a game that's not just about sports. It's a full-on golfing adventure with a whole lot of tennis gameplay for good measure. Not to mention dungeons, espionage, <laughs> mini-games, and plenty of friends and enemies to meet on your way to the DECA Sportathon. Sports Story launches exclusively on Nintendo exclusively? Switch in mid-2020. Okay. I gotta try Golf Story. I haven't tried it yet. It's one of those that's on the list of like, when I have time, I'll download it. Streets of Race 4, let's go. But I haven't downloaded it yet. This looks so Let's go. There will be plenty of braised chicken lying First around on plates and bad guys to beat down when Streets of Rage 4 comes to Nintendo Switch in the first half of 2020. グリムライトはステンドグラスをモチーフとしたアーティスティックの世界。静かで不思議な物語を描くと想像的なゲームで、ミステリーストーリーを描いているんですが、どんな旅をするんでしょうか。ぜひグリムライトの世界を楽しん
No UI. Hi everyone, I'm Alexander Fernandez, CEO of Streamline Media Group, and today Bake we're going to be showing Switch. you our brand new game, Bake and Switch. It's a uh, violently cute couch co-op game that I think you're going to like. We like it. In fact, we liked it so much, we made it about food because we like to eat. <laughs> that's pretty good. Yeah. Mm, that's pretty... Yeah. Wow, that's the bliss ball right there. <laughs> there you go. Mm. So we hope you guys like it. More importantly, <laughs> we hope you enjoy it because food? we had to work really hard on it, baking this and making sure it works. So please enjoy it and let us know what you think. Hi. You see those cuddly dough things? They simply yeah. must be sacrificed to the guardians <laughs> of dough. And so in it this party baller, you and up to three other players need to work as a team to punch, combine, and bake those doughs before time runs out. This in-your-face co-op action may be easy to pick up, but trust me, it's tough Sounds to master familiar. all the challenging mechanics in each level. And you guys in player know I'm versus going player this. mode, it's every baker for themselves. Bacon Switch will cook up something special on Nintendo Switch in summer 2020. Um, I forgot the cookie. Hey, Nintendo fans! On behalf of the team here at Digital Continue, I'm excited to announce our new game, oh, Super. Bad Room. Super Mesh is a, a game room, that bro. makes games. Learn from me. It's a love letter to game terrible audio. <laughs> set in a game shop owned by a brother and sister, discover a mysterious game console. The magic of Super Mesh is what we didn't do. Super the games mesh. it produces are not scripted. It's the game itself that mashes the genres together and creates a different game every time you play. You never know what it's going to do. Okay. Just do me one favor, okay? This is the code to my favorite mash. When you pick up Super Mash for the Nintendo Switch next year, put it in. What? Let me know what you think. I'm, I'm confused. If a game can make a Every game. I'm predictable Oh my god. It is on the fence. We match in every I'm gonna say the Sims. Sounds hella cool. It sounds really cool. Super Mash will shake things up on Nintendo okay. Switch in May 2020. Okay. What would you do if the world around you was as strange and contradictory as ancient oh, ruins built I know what this is. technology? This is um, well, in this first-person puzzle. puzzle game, you're about to find out. Tasked by your creator with solving a series of complex puzzles, you'll divert drones, manipulate laser beams, and even replicate time to prove your worth or find a way out. Who are you? What's your purpose? As you choose you your own path through this non-linear world, uncover the clues you need to decide for yourself. Ooh. You'll have more than 120 puzzles to solve when the Talus Principle Deluxe Edition comes to Nintendo Talus Switch Principle. later today. Oh, today, okay. Ah, oh, nothing quite like a high seas adventure combining classic naval action with exploration. What? Really makes you want to expand your fleet and do battle with pirates, sea monsters, even the sea itself. Let's go. The entire Pirating. map is procedurally generated, and all across it you'll discover islands to explore and quests to take, from rescuing sailors to looting pirates. And you'll do it all from your custom boat. You pick okay. the design, colors, weapons, and equipment. As you progress, okay. you'll add new boats to your fleet and give orders to the crew on boats you aren't sailing yourself. Better keep track of the wind and use physics to your advantage. When Sailforth sails into port on Sail Nintendo Force. Switch in 2020. Okay. A lot of 2020 games. Lot of 2020 Hello everyone, games, uh, I'm Nick Clifford, Dauntless. developer here at Phoenix Labs. Since when you last it? saw us when during Nintendo Treehouse live at E3 earlier this year, we've been hard at work developing our hit online action RPG Dauntless for the Nintendo Switch system. Mm -hmm. We're absolutely thrilled to share a fresh look at our game including the reveal of our new content expansion, Storm Chasers, complete with the Sky okay. Fighter armor and Sky mm -hmm. Metal weapon set. 
These cosmetic items will be available at launch exclusively to players on the Nintendo Switch for free. We hope you enjoy your first look at the next evolution of Dauntless, and we'll see you in the Shattered Isles. Let's go, Dauntless. Another game I haven't touched. Once they said that it was coming to the Switch, I was like, uninstall on the PC, because I had it uninstalled, and I never touched it. I was like, I'm gonna play it on Switch. Because I play Fortnite on Switch, right? And it's just my pick up, go play an online session for like maybe 10, 20 minutes, and then put it back down. today boy play now let's go all right in dauntless you're all that stands between your world and the massive boss-sized behemoths that seek to devour it with cross-platform and cross-region play you can slay with your friends no matter where they play let's and go. with cross-save functionality okay. you can take your slayer on the go with nintendo switch no matter where you began your adventure Oh, okay, so form a lit. hunting party and forge your legacy. I didn't even know it was gonna challenging be challenging um... co-op battles in this rich, evolving world. Create deadly weapons and powerful armor from the very creatures you slay. I didn't know it was gonna be in rich um, customization for a and crafting systems. Look forward to regular, free content updates featuring new challenges, new behemoths, and more. When Dauntless launches as a free download on Nintendo Switch later today. Free download. Can't get mad at that, man. Hollywood, the 90s. An actress on a hit TV show soon finds herself starring in her own murder mystery. Can you Free and your download. robot scout crack the case one nonogram at a time? Guess your only option is to dig up clues while jamming out to tracks from Masakazu Sugimori, the composer behind Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney and Beautiful Joe. Along the way, you'll interrogate weird and wonderful characters designed by Hato Moa of Hatoful Boyfriend fame. Okay. From TV studios to glitzy award shows, you must uncover a tangled web of conspiracy, deception, and, of course, murder, as you piece together the truth one pixel at a time. Down. It's no longer a mystery. Murder by Numbers launches first as a timed exclusive on Nintendo Switch in early 2020. What is this? I'm sorry, I didn't check it out. This Murder mysterious bounty hunter. Oh, world, yes! Because that's a This name. is dope. He is a classic. Guns, but he I will just kindly the, take your uh, mula in exchange for the bounties he collects. Why? This is dope. He needs the cash bad. I said the PS. And he'll hunt down every <laughs> outlaw in the, Mongo um, Valley if that's what it takes. Problem is, there's a bounty on his head, too. In oh, this not adventure a mobile game, version. you'll wield Stranger's unusual crossbow that fires off normal. rounds of live ammo from rodents to bugs, and you'll earn bigger bounties for live captures. With updated FPS controls and gyroscopic aiming, the definitive version of this classic is fast approaching. Oddworld Stranger's Wrath January. launches on Nintendo okay. Switch in January 2020. You can pre-purchase it later today. HD, oh. let's go. Oh man, Skateboard. why is this so adorable? <laughs> you take an ordinary skateboard, you put a bird on it, and just look at him go. Who wouldn't want to be a skateboard? <laughs> Whether they're skateboard. grinding on bendy straws, kick flipping over staplers, or carving lines through a park held together by sticky tape, skateboards always try their best, don't they? <laughs> Explore each park, collect tiny clothing, help out fellow birds, and find secret mixtapes of original lo-fi bird hop tunes. Before long, you'll be catching air like only a bird could. When Skatebird launches on Nintendo uh, Switch in late 2020. Late 2020 is so far away. Comic book similar. Excuse me if I look cold, I'm just, it's cold in here. Don't stop me. Overrated, coming to the Nintendo.
Nintendo's for 2020. Again, another 2020 game. They just love On this indie showcase. You saw it for yourself in the trailer, people. Liberated blends the art of cyberpunk, hand-drawn graphic novels with interactivity and action to create one seamless experience. In this near-future dystopia, the eerily familiar, always online society gives way to complete government control. Okay. But that always won't stop an insurgent society. group called Liberated from rising up. But this Got is no simple tale left. of good versus evil. As you flip between pages, side-scrolling stealth gunplay and platforming action, you must witness what transpires mm. from many points of Ooh. view to parse the Excuse truth. Me. Liberated will release first as a timed exclusive on Nintendo Switch Nintendo in 2020. Switch first. And we're Hi, first. we're Kid Boss Games, and this is our hey. game, Boyfriend Dungeon, a dating simulator Boyfriend and dungeon, dungeon crawler mashup. We are super excited to announce that Boyfriend Dungeon will be coming to the Boyfriend Nintendo dungeon? Switch, which means you'll be able to date your weapons at home and on the go. Date your weapons? If you're like me, then you're never going to forget your summer stay at Verona Beach, where you're tasked with clearing out all the creatures in the dungeon. Okay. Oh, what? and it only gets better, because the weapons you can find there transform into cutes, and they're single. Forge <laughs> precious memories with your many loves, no. and use their individual combat styles to clear out all the monsters as you uncover the dungeon's <laughs> secrets together. Did I mention okay. romantic dates? Oh, be still my heart. Oh, and there's also the Nintendo Switch exclusive HD Rumble function. Level up your love when Boyfriend Dungeon comes to Nintendo Boyfriend Switch Dungeon. in 2020. Boyfriend Sometimes Dungeon. the only way to face a tough subject is head on. Even if that means battling a nightmarish depression living inside a young woman's subconscious. Thankfully, you'll have an expansive combat system on your side, combining a brawler, a top-down shooter, stop. and a dungeon crawler. Every time you slumber, you'll face another randomized dungeon found in one of the game's beautifully haunting dreamscapes, oh, littered okay. with powerful artifacts, challenges, and puzzles. Forge friendships in your waking life and use their hopes and dreams to dispel the darkness within. You'll warp the dreamscape around you with lucid powers that alter the flow of time and space when Dreamscaper launches first on Nintendo Switch as a timed exclusive on consoles in early 2020. That sounds... that sounds like... Hey everyone, we're extremely excited to reveal a brand new game we've been working on at Team 17. We've combined crafting, base building and survival, along with a few surprises, in a is new that... adventure set within the Escapist universe. And on Nintendo Switch, you can play with three of your friends in local wireless and online multiplayer. We hope okay. you enjoy the video. Okay. Oh, so this is, um, Epic Games, so the, um, what's it called, the Escapist? <laughs> what is this, the Survivalist? Is that in the, okay, Escapist Universe. The survivalist, yep. Yeah, I said it right. Easy Whether you're crafting, one, building, or yes, training monkeys, survival is the name of the game. Look at the monkeys! These procedurally generated islands are alive. They change during the day-night cycle, and they're riddled with adventure and a wealth of secrets. As you, or your monkeys, gather resources the and monkeys. craft items, you'll uncover your own recipes and multiple crafting trees. That should help you overcome the hidden threats lurking within temples, okay. full of exotic riches and slick weaponry. You can play co-op locally or online with up to three friends who each have their own game and system to try and survive okay. together. However, not everyone will be pleased to see you thrive. The Survivalists releases on Nintendo Switch in 2020. Sounds lit. We're coming to the end of our presentation. Thanks for watching. So we'd like got to take a, a moment to thank all of our partners for giving Nintendo Switch owners so much to look forward to. Well said, Kirk. On behalf of Nintendo, thank you so much. Yeah, I got one and more thanks thing. to all of you left. for joining us. Although, now that I think about it, there is one more of thing. Of course, there is. Of course. Hi, I'm Tom Happ, creator of Axiom Verge. 
I just wanted oh, to take this moment new to thank both Nintendo and Nintendo fans for the love you've shown Axiom Verge over the years. I've been quietly working on the next installment of Axiom Verge for about oh. four years now. Jesus. Here's a peek. Let's go. You are not in control. You are not. You belong to us now. Same more style. It looks like a little bit of 3D stuff. Okay. Yep, just two. Okay. 24, 2020. I gotta complete that game. That's a game I have on um, the Epic Game Store. And I got far, what is it? I haven't gone too deep into it, but I love Metroidvania, so that's the game that I definitely got to complete before that one comes out. Cool, cool indie, little short indie showcase. I obviously, the big boy is gonna be Dauntless. Video on that coming tomorrow, probably. Once I get all of these trailer reaction reviews up, I did one on the Sony State of Play, following with this one. Hopefully all of these will be up before the Game Awards. I'm gonna try to rush these out. I'm gonna try Dauntless and do a video for you guys you guys know how i do so that's probably the biggest thing that came and sports story is one that i'm actually interested in as well talus talus of principle available later today i gotta try that one out the game that makes games weird cool idea streets race 4 i'm gonna get um but that's next year a lot of these stuff is just like next year um bait and switch not not for me pirate game looks cool again 2020 uh, we have to wait to to see that murder by numbers nah not for me um outworld definitely gonna pick that up in january skateboard i love the idea definitely getting that but that's super far away that's late 2020 but the trailer looked dope um, liberated, not for me. Um, the boyfriend simulator, the boyfriend with weapons. It looks dope. It looks like a dope game. I'm not gonna front on that. Maybe not for me, but I'll definitely dabble in it if I could. E Fox, send me a code. I I'll dabble in it. Um, boyfriend dungeon. The dream escape looks crazy. That's definitely a, a, a pickup. That definitely looks cool. I want to see if that's coming to other consoles as well. The survivalist, dope, dope idea. And the fact that it's multiplayer is pretty cool. And of course, Ashley and Verge 2, which again, dope, dope, dope. Pretty solid on the indie side. I was kind of hoping that we got, like if Ashley Verge developer was like, yo, we making a Metroid, nigga, like, <laughs> I would have been crazy, but we, from from what we got, is it wasn't too bad. It was uh, like they said, an indie showcase. They didn't hype it up. They just said, "Hey, this is coming out in a couple of days, and this is what it is, and that's what it was." It was just an indie showcase. Nothing too hype, but definitely solid game solid gems in here let me know which one you're gonna be trying out once it releases are you picking up dauntless if you are and if you are a dauntless player let me know your thoughts on it in the comment section below let's chat it up let's play because we this cross platform as well so let's jump in let's try it out i'm trying it out on the nintendo switch as soon as it finishes downloading and i'm gonna do a video for you guys so let me know your thoughts of the indie showcase again i answer all comments so leave your comments down below if you're new around here here i do videos like this all the time trailer reactions play games pokemon videos nintendo switch videos i do it all here if you want to see content just like this again hit that subscribe button ring the bell if you want to be notified the next time i drop a video hit the like button it does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel's concerned pushing the video and to recommend it so other people can check out the video peace i love you guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next one like always guys i'm daddy gamer fred on instagram and twitter and you guys can bring the conversation there i'm the american gamer in switzerland right here on youtube and yes i'm gonna be doing a ton of videos just like this one so if you enjoy please hit that subscribe button also hit the like button it does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time i drop a video peace i'm gonna see you guys on the next one